This is Liberté. She's our Kaufman 47 foot sloop. Uh, they're pretty rare. There's only 30 or less of these in the world. We recently retrofitted her in 2019 with a whole variety of things that I'll go through. Um, but maybe one of the most important of which is we just stripped everything off and redid all of the whole paint with all grip paint. Let me take you aboard and show you some of the features here in the cockpit. You can see our variant winches. Uh, the primaries are 32s, secondaries are 28s. Uh, right below me here is where we fill our water tanks. There's a center tank that holds 100 gallons uh, and then two 25 gallon tanks, port and starboard, uh, not to mention the 12 gallon holding tanks. Uh, here you can see the instrument panel. It's a little hard to see right now, but with the naked eye, it's much easier. And of course, all of those will illuminate when it's nighttime. So here are the lazarettes. Well, this is one of the two lazarettes. It's a little hard to see here. It's much easier to see with a naked eye, but these are quite deep. Um, you can climb in there yourself and actually get access to the engine, among other things. But these drop down about five feet, and they also um, extend backwards towards the stern. So there's just a ton of room in both of these. We store quite a lot of things there. Let me take you forward and show you some of the other features here. Um, we recently stripped off and polished all the bright work. Uh, there are brand new deck fittings. We've rebuilt the hatches. And uh, here you can see some of the ground tackle. We have a 50 pound Bruce anchor with a 100 foot chain and 200 feet of nylon. And this is a Lumar 12 volt windlass. So let me take you below and show you a few other things. Okay, let me take you down below here, show you some of the other work that we've done, and a bit more of Liberté. This is our galley here, and our salon. And behind me are two of the three staterooms. Here is the port stateroom. Uh, these mattresses are quite comfortable. We slept many, many nights here. And there's quite a lot of thoughtfully laid out storage. Really just all of down below is um, very intelligently designed. There's quite a lot of room for things here. Here's our coat rack where we store some of our foul weather gear. All of our jackets and hats and the like for when we go sailing are stored down here. Here you can see the starboard stateroom. Pretty much designed in the exact same fashion. And let me show you a little bit of the galley. There on the left you can see our Seafrost DC5000 cold plate refrigerator and freezer. And this here is our Force 10 propane uh, oven and stove. Really a very comfortable and functional kitchen. And here's our salon, where we uh, spent quite a few evenings. And here is our HDTV, which connects not only to um, instrumentation, but you know it also has 5.1 sound and a DVD player. So you watch a few movies down here. Uh, both of those um, benches expand outwards into more bunks for, for, for entertaining more people. I won't go into the details here because they're much better to read, but you can see our instrument panel. The chart table is pretty interesting. have um, this rotating swivel chair here. Also, I should mention we have a long-range custom-built antenna, so you can catch Wi-Fi from whatever dock you're at, so long as they have it, you can be in the worst spot and you'll be able to pick up the signal. Here's the V-Berth. It's also very comfortable. I personally lived in this V-Berth for four or five months, slept here every night. Uh, yeah, and it was more than adequate. Uh, this is one of the two heads. This one's manual. The one in the back is electric. And you can see that there's a shower here and the water just drains away beneath you. So you can just shut the door and easily have a shower in here. So this is Liberté. If you're interested in uh, taking a look, let us know. Come by and see her.